a NASA rover exploring a large crater on Mars has discovered that the basin once held a massive lake and a river delta. The Perseverance rover landed on Mars back in February 2021, and since then, it has steadily been collecting samples, looking for signs of life on the Red Planet. The rover has spent the last three years exploring Jezero Crater, which is 28 miles wide, and was formed by an asteroid impact nearly four billion years ago. While exploring the site and searching for samples, Perseverance found evidence that the sprawling crater was once a lake. Scientists were able to put together a detailed timeline of the lake's history, which is separated into three distinct periods. In the first period, fine sand and mud known for preserving fossil life made its way into the crater. Next, sedimentary layers formed as the lake expanded, stretching 22 miles across and reaching depths of 100 feet. Finally, high-energy rivers formed that carried boulders across the surface of Mars. During its 1,000 days on Mars, the Perseverance rover has collected 23 rock samples from the crater. The robot bores into the ground and removes a chunk of rock about the size of a stick of chalk and stores the sample in a specially made metal tube. Some of these samples have contained signs that the lake may have been home to microbial life, according to NASA. One sample contained a notable amount of silica, which preserves fossils here on Earth. Another sample showed a large quantity of phosphate, which is a critical building block in life on Earth, and it is a component of DNA and is found in cell membranes. Perseverance has also determined the crater floor is made up of igneous rock formed from magma or volcanic activity underground. Above the igneous rock, there are layers of sandstone and mudstone, indicators of the formation of the rivers that flowed into the lake. The mudstone is also rich in salt, indicating that the lake experienced evaporation. The rover is able to determine the makeup of the rock using the specialized instruments it's fitted with. These tools are capable of detecting both microscopic fossil-like structures and chemical changes left behind by ancient microbes. But so far, it hasn't recorded either of these signs of life. Still, NASA scientists remain hopeful that the evidence of ancient life is out there. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe for more video.